Welcome to Ashley Marie. Today I'm going to show you how I level my cakes easily and quickly. There's a ton of tools out there for leveling your cake and I have found that none of them work very well. Uh, the little one with the wire, you know, you push it through and the wire tends to snag on things. Uh, the long one with the serrated blade, it's really flimsy and it tends to bend as you go through your cake so it's never completely level, it's really annoying. So I find I have the best luck with a very strong serrated knife. This is the same knife that I use for cake carving that I talk about in the other video. So, oh, get a turntable, stand in front of your cake comfortably. If you stand in a really uncomfortable position, you're gonna find that you slowly go back into whatever's comfortable for you, and then you'll end up moving your knife. So, you know, feet shoulder length apart, you know, make sure that your knees and ugh, everything's loose and comfortable. Hold your knife with your elbow tucked into your side. And the first time around, we're just gonna mark it. So we're gonna let the turntable do the work for us. We're just gonna barely hold our blade in and turn our cake making sure to just hold our knife in the exact same spot. And as we go all the way around, it's gonna create a nice little mark for us. And it should, by the, by the time you get all the way around, you should meet the same mark that you started at the exact same place. If you didn't, it means you are moving your knife around and you should probably start over again. That's why the first time around, we just mark it. So now that we have a good guide, a good mark, we're gonna keep turning it, but pressing that blade further in. And as you can see, it's doing the work for us, the turntable. It's taking this really nice, strong serrated blade and doing the work for us. And as you get to the center, you'll feel it kind of pop away, pop, and you're done. And now we have a cake that is perfectly level. If you're trying to get a bunch of layers the exact same height, what I'll do is I'll put the next layer on, I'll bring the old layer back, and I'll use that to help guide where I'm gonna start my knife. All right, that's how it's done. Super easy, super fast, and perfectly level every single time. Now we have three perfectly level, perfectly even layers, and we're ready to frost, fill, and stack. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys found this tip easy and that you give it a shot. Let me know how it goes. Don't forget to leave me a comment if there's anything else you guys want to see and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss anything.